Hi everybody, welcome back. I am your host Anna and today we're going to be doing something a little bit different. If you did notice in one of my friend mails, I method beauty sent to me three beauty items in my friend mail. So I wanted to go ahead and give them a go. The first one is this I method beauty power on plumping lip gloss. And it has like this really cute figure of this um, girl with her little sassy red swimsuit, honey. Or it could be a corset. It looks like a swimsuit. There you go. Then the next one is going to be the perfect eyebrows in seconds. Now, I don't have not one, not one lick of um, any kind of makeup, nothing on my face. So we're going to see how this works out. I haven't done my brows or nothing. So there you go. We're going to figure it out together. And this is sold, I believe, on Amazon. Then the iMethod Beauty Waterproof Smudge Proof Long Lasting Winged Eyeliner Stamp. Wing Eyeliner Stamp. Okay, so this one might be a little bit more... Uh, how, you, how would you say it would be... It's gonna be probably going to be a little bit more work for me. Because I'm normally I don't do wings. So... I am pulling out my other mirror right here and we're going to look at this kit. So that's the, what they sent to me was three color 03 for the brows. So let's, let's look at this kit. So you get a stencil, pomade, a sponge brush, dual ended spoolie and angle brush, all enclosed in a zip pouch. Okay. So let's check it out. There's this little zip pouch. Very nice. Okay, it's like a plastic. It's like a plastic um, little zip pouch. And this is iMethod. All right. Then let's look inside because we got to get these brows done, honey. Okay, so we do have this fully. And it looks like it has the thing for the stamp. Here's this fully. The angle brush, I guess that's like the little stamper. And it's cute because it comes in this white handle with a little white puff. Very cute. Then inside we're also going to find... Oh, look, they actually included tweezers. Nice. So tweezers. Very nice. We have, it looks like the pomade. Oh, here are the stencils. There's two different groups of stencils. So two different groups of stencils with several stencils on the inside. And we're going to figure this one out together to find out which one is best for me. I don't know. And this is the Brow Pomade Sculpt and Define. Okay. So I guess that's what you stamp it with. It looks like that. They give you some stickers. You got your instruction manual here so it looks like the first thing is you want to identify your points point one point two is my high point and then point three okay so those are my points so i have to choose a stencil that best fits by aligning the stencil on your eyebrow okay so let's do that first these look kind of thin they all kind of look like they're on the thin side. I have like big brows. I don't got big brows. Or I guess it might be considered big for some. So let's see what we can find that's going to match us best. Okay. This is the first container. Oh, see, this one might work right here. This one might work. Let's see. Yeah, that one might work. This one might work for me. This one. Let me look at let me look at a couple of other ones. Okay. All right. No, that one's gonna be too thin. Um because I want something that's gonna really give me my shape. Mm hmm Yes, there's my shape. This this is my shape. See that? I know I'm just running my fingers over it. And it goes all this one might be a good one. I don't know. This one compared to this one. This other one is goes up a little higher. 
yeah this is more my jam right here the one that goes a little higher because my eyebrow does poke up higher like that okay so i'm going to use this one okay bingo schmingo we found one with not too much trouble so they do have a very nice variation they do have a very nice variation and um there you go now the next thing i'm going to do is i'm going to look at this again i know i'm doing it right along with you i'm so scared it says dip it says dip the sponge into the pomade okay then it says fill in the angled brush to apply the pomade okay blend as you go uh-huh okay so this is my the pomade that they picked out for me i didn't pick this color i don't know if this color is going to work for me at all so i'm dipping it i'm actually moving it around because there we go i had to move it around to get enough on there then i'm going to take my brow stencil right here because it's not really covering the whole thing but I'm gonna make sure I got it on here good the way I want it and let's see what that does sponge is very soft okay and I just want to make sure I go over it a lot I've never done a stencil before you guys never so far it's looking pretty good I think I'm gonna dip it just a little bit more and go over it again because I just want to make sure I get a good fill okay wow wow <laughs> holy wow i kind of like it i know it's really out there because you know whenever you do your brows and you're kind of doing them differently okay let me do the other one let me do this other one wow okay so i need to flip this one over let me refill my pomade and you guys when i'm refilling it i actually move it around in there i get it in there good because i want to make sure my spoolie is covered really good again this is number zero three the one they, they picked out for me okay so i'm just going over just flipping over the same one there we go i think that's is that a good yeah i think that's a good i think that's a good uh let me get my hair out of the way let me get my hair out of the way you guys okay there we go all right ready now you see what that one looks like let me make sure i have it lined up good here okay because we don't want to We don't want it. We want it to match the best that, that we can. And I'm looking at my camera here, my cell phone, to match it up. Okay, I can feel my hair. Can't really feel it down here, though. There we go. Okay, I think I'm going to leave it like that. All right, let's start putting it in. Hopefully, I did it right. If not, we're going to see some crooked eyebrows which i will have to try to fix okay how's it looking how's that looking okay i'm gonna do it again okay so for all you guys that are having problems with your eyelashes so not eyelashes your eyebrows 
This is an option. This is from iMethod Beauty. And they sell it on Amazon. Let's see. A little bit more. I want to make sure I have it just as much as the other side. And then we could try to fix whatever we might need to fix. Mm. I don't know if I... Mm. It's like I could tell the difference. Like I didn't do them. I wish I could switch my face up a little bit. But yeah, no, I can't do that. Okay, so I'm going to bend this spoolie over just a little bit. And just go like this. Now I did this, I did this like this because I want to make sure you guys can see it. I want to make sure I can see it. Now let's just do a very quick, let's do a very quick eye look. Okay, let's do a quick eye look. So I'm going to take out my violet, my violet, my violet Voss Violet Sunset kit out. And let's just do a very super quick eye look here just so we can get a better idea for these eyebrows like I you know you get to pick the ones that you like now I'm only going to use like two shades here I'm going to use dusk so I'm going to use two shades I'm going to use dusk and I'm probably going to use this one just those two shades today just to do a quick eye look all right now I do have hooded eyes I do have hooded eyes so you gotta keep that in mind everybody's gonna be a little bit different so I'm just trying to do my corner really quick and then I'm just gonna move it over into my crease and I do have I'm patting my brush down because I forgot to uh, shake out my brush okay so there we, there we go now we're doing this and I normally have to bring up my eye color pretty high because I have a hooded eye so if I want to see the eye color I have to bring it up really high up here into the section okay now I'm gonna I've got my handy dandy little napkin here I'm just trying to lighten up my brush a little bit here okay and then I'm just gonna go over it over and over and over again for a little bit okay now I'm gonna do the other side real quick I always have more problems doing this side of my face it's always easier to do the right than the other side again like I said I'm only going to try to do two colors now I'm shaking up my brush tapping it out okay and I'm bringing it up pretty high she could tell all the way up to here because I have hooded eyes so you, you're not going to really see my color unless I bring it all the way up. Okay. You're just not, you're not going to see it. Okay. So the next thing we're going to do, we're going to use this other color. Like I said, we're going to use the other color. Thank you, sweetheart. Thanks. My husband just brought me some breakfast. So I'm going to get down to business after I do this video. <laughs> going to get down to business, honey. Okay, so I'm going to use that light color, uh, and I'm going to put it, first of all, up here, up here, and I'm going to bring it all the way over, okay, like that. I'm going to dip into it again right here. Like I said, I'm only doing two colors today, just two colors. And then I'm going to lighten all this up too. 
Okay, this is just part of my process. And then I'm going to tap, tap, tap in here. Because I want this to lighten up right here. See that? So I'm going to tap, tap, tap right there. Tap, 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 tap it. And then I want to bring it up because I want to lighten this section up here. Okay. I want to bring some more color right here. All right. And right there, I want to bring in some more color. All right. So we're getting there. We're getting there. So with just two colors, I'm going to clean off my brush until most of the color comes off. Then I'm going to play around with it again. Okay. So then we're going to play around with this over, 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 over. This way it's all going to kind of like blend. Okay. I'm never good at doing eye tutorials. I don't. I am not a professional whatsoever. All kinds of people are like, girl, you're doing it wrong. You're doing it wrong. Don't do it like that. Don't. <laughs> this is just what I do. You don't have to do what I do. I'm going to just bring a little bit more of that chocolate brown back up here. Just a little tad back over there because I need like just a little bit more right here. Right here. Okay. Now let's see what this winged thing is here. Again, this is from Eye Method. This is the Winged Eyeliner Eyeliner Stamp. I'm not just sure what it is. Now I don't know if I finished everything I'm supposed to finish here. I was supposed to blend, use a spoolie, brush for natural look. Um, okay. Let's see. Oh, it has two products. Okay. So we have two products in here. We got left wing, right wing. So this is for the left. And this is left. Oh, so it's an actual wing. Wow. I don't... What's, oh, so you could do like a wing stamp or they have this. I'm going to use this. And I might play around with the wing stamp. I've never done a wing. I just never, I've never done a wing. So I'm going to do a very light, very light going down on my eye right here. See that? Very light. Okay. There we go. Let's do this other side. Very light. Try not to mess it up while I'm here with you guys. Now, please know I don't have blush on or anything else. So maybe I'll do that too. I don't know. I didn't put concealer or anything. This is just eyebrows and eyeshadow color. Now, I was trying to do like a, a dramatic look for you guys today. What I will do is I'm going to use my um, my Lights Camera Lashes, my Tarte Mascara Lights Camera Lashes here for my, for my eyes so we could try to finish up this look. So you can get a full view. I don't have lashes. I do have lashes that I got in the mail, but I just haven't started to try them out because I never do lashes. And my lashes are very, very thin and sparse. So it always takes me a little while to do this. Because I don't have that much to play with. That was so nice of my husband to make breakfast this morning. That's awesome sauce. Okay, so let me continue to try to do the mascara here. Again, this is the Tarte Lights Camera. Lights Camera Flash or something like that? I don't know. Okay, and I never do my bottom 
my bottom um, lashes because I have hooded eyes and my eyes leak. <laughs> so let's check check out this Eye Method Power On Plumping Lip Gloss. This is what they sent. I really like the brows. I like the way the brows came out. I actually like it. I think they came out, I mean, I think they came out pretty good. All right, so she looks like that. And this particular color is called 80, it's either 806 or 608. I know, right? It's either 80, it's 608. It should be 608. And let's see what she looks like. All right, it's definitely a gloss. It's smooth. Mm -hmm. Mm. I think it might, this might be plumping. Yep, plump, fill, and lift. Plump, fill, and lift. Because I could feel the tingling on my lips. I could feel the tingling, girl. All right, so what I'm going to do, I know I'm kind of doing this a little backwards. But I'm just going to put a little bit of my CC cream, my, my IT Cosmetics Bye Bye Foundation Full Coverage with 50 SPF concealer. I'm just going to put a little bit underneath my eye, underneath both my eyes, because I know I got some fallout from my, from my, um, my look here. And I'm just going to do it with, with my hand. And I didn't do anything for my dark lash, for my under eyes. I should say, this is what I normally do first. But since I just wanted to do the product per se first, so you could see the true view of the product, I think they look really nice. Um, I think I need to angle it a little bit more, but I'm sure that if I wanted to, I could fix them up. I could probably fix it up, fix it up a little bit. This one had like, I didn't, I angled it down a little bit more. So I could add the pomade on here and angle it a little bit more with this angle brush. Okay. And then let me put a little blusher on. Okay. I'm going to put some of my Tarte. This is the Tarte Peach Sunset Cream. Cream blush. I usually just put my sponge in it. I know. And I try to do it right here. So it looks like I got a little sun on my face. Okay. Okay. Mm, not bad. I actually like it. Do you guys like it? I actually like it. I know I just need to fix it, but I'm not going to fix it with you guys. But now I got to get used to doing it. And I like this kit. I actually like this kit. I like the lips. The lips feel good. I feel the tingling sensation. It was easy to use. Um, this perfect eyebrows in seconds. Super easy to use. I love that it had all the tools in it for you. Um, this is nice. And the eyeliner, you know, it's nice. And it has this winged stamp. This is for the right. I don't know how I'm afraid to use it. I'm afraid to use this. Let me see. Let me see. This is for the left. So if I put it on, I'm going to put it on my skin. Oh, so it does that. See, I don't, I don't. It's like they sent it to me and it was nice for them to send it to me because I wasn't expecting it at all. Um, let me see. I don't know if I really want to have a winged look right now, but should we do a winged look? 
Let's see. Okay, I just did it. I don't like the wing look. I'm not used to the wing look. I don't think I did it right. I did it too high. I did this too high. Let me see if I can. Yeah, that's wet. Let me see if I could take it off. Yeah, I was able to take it off easily. Okay. I was able I was, I was able to save my look. <laughs> well, I like the eyeliner. They have the wing. If you guys don't know how to do your wings, you can do the wing stamp. You know, I like that. They have that kit. I like the lip. This look color is really pretty. It's making my lips tingle, so I'm feeling really cute right now. I am loving the eyebrow look, you guys. I just got to play around with it a little bit more, but I'm really feeling this whole full lush look. It's making me feel like younger or something. I don't know, but I like it. So thank you, iMethod, for sending me that in friend mail. Thank you so much because I'm really like digging this. Um, I if if I can find the links on Amazon for you guys, I'll link them up down below so you guys can go check it out. Okay, and that's it. Hope you guys enjoyed. Bye.